let's get out there and do that good deed for those nice sand people. Also, get good at sloop racing. All of that. Now, the glasses have grown on me. I gotta say, look at that. Look at that Matrix ass party. Oh, yeah. Fucking chilling out there. Anyway. I want onward. to apologize to the viewer at home. Uh, we How about you apologize to me? I didn't piss my pants. All right. You know what? Okay. <laughs> How about that? And then you swerve back to whatever the fuck you were gonna talk about. I can take that photo again. Don't- that's- that's- there's no need for that photo to go anywhere. Yeah? However... Yeah? Are you I, sure? You gave me a heart attack at a time when my heart could not take it. Hey, listen, I look over at Wooly. He comes in, he's- he's, he's quite late today. He was fixing- fixing technical foibles. He comes in and he rushes in. He's clearly in a- in a perturbed. You know, he's clearly had a, a rough morning, so to speak, right? Sure. And then he w he sits down, and I look over, and it appears to me that in his haste to get out the door or stress from some shenanigans, Wooly has pissed all over himself. This is what it looks like to my eye. <laughs> to your eye. Now, Wooly is wearing, what would you call that, light green, gray pants? They're just, they're just gray. With a massive... Shadowy piss stain no all over the dick area. Proper authorization. <laughs> now, this later, about ten seconds later, was revealed to be the hilariously shaped shadow <laughs> from our microphone set up with our with our with uh, the light with just casting booth. it and it perfectly. Just, it just happens on to look like you dick. pissed all over yourself. Now, the immediate heart attack that is, no, I didn't. Oh God, what if I did? Is not a good feeling. And not something that you, I want to be waking me up in the morning. It's like, of course not. Of course I didn't piss myself. And then you have the millisecond it takes to actually look down <laughs> and go, ah. But wouldn't it be fuck? I'm gonna. We're gonna be it's stealing that from my patch wall all the time. But wouldn't it be fucked up if you, you did down. though? <laughs> oh my god. Anyway, you were apologizing for. Uh, we appear to have mole people attempting to break into yeah, the there's office. That. There's that. So if you hear any mole people drills, please ignore that. We are taking our best steps in order to really combat do, them. But I can't. You can't imagine how yeah. sorry I am. Yeah, yeah, people it's are trying that, to break in. And I'm sick about this. And I'm I waiting for. I have to swipe the gate lock with your authorization. I haven't got a choice. Where do I get that authorization? Only one place, and it means dangerous work. Hunting license. Go to the Zerka office for a hunting license. Oh, they Zerka gave you the authority lodge. to buy a hunting license, but, but not, the not actually give you one. Itself. What a roundabout RPG manner of doing things. What a bunch- Oh, you know what? You can use HK to talk to that little guy right next to you, because yeah. he can translate. No, not that one, the one behind you. The leader? Yeah, is he's With the bunch? Speak no. to me for another time. What do you want? Yeah, what? What's up? Find my people. I mean, it doesn't seem like you need oh, to. Oh yeah, he's fine. That's weird. It's not so hard to understand him. But... So does that just mean that everyone who told you that was like a massive racist asshole? Uh, it's like all oh, these mm -hmm. fucking. Say I can't understand a word they're saying. It's all gibberish. And it's it's super. And it's just... like, hey, I'm Steve. Yeah. <laughs> That's like that's like go like yelling at Yoda's race for being the way it is. It Why do you like, gotta talk like that? It's because the force. Just the way we I can think of a of, of uh, a head cannon reason for that stupid style speaking right now. Because it's kind of like Japanese. No, because Yoda's race are so strong with the force that their ability to see into the future a couple seconds is constant and permanent and thus causes their sentences to be uttered out of order due to their own confusion. That's stupid. Yeah, well, That's welcome stupid. to Star Wars. That's stupid, I don't like it. Yeah, I bet you don't like it. You're in the wrong building, motherfucker. I don't like a lot of things. Hello is she again. the one? I hear you've no, she gave you the, the ability to buy a pass. Now you go get a pass. Farewell. In the actual headquarters. Yeah, from Faza. I want to burp so bad into this microphone. microphone. Uh, well, it's your fucking mic. It's also there. You go. It's your it's your burp shield. Oh man. How much would I have to pay you to lick this pop guard? I there's no <laughs> number because I'm a happy person living an enjoyable life. All right. I, I, there's no. What number. would I have to threaten you with to lick this pop guard? Like a gun? There's you know. I mean, really, this this line of questioning. Whose pop guard would you lick for free? <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> this line of questioning goes absolutely nowhere. What I will say is congratulations with that burp. You've now hit on to at least one person's like sick dang weird, fetish. weird fetish. Yeah. And now they've got it on audio form. Fuck yeah. So. Yeah, give me a hunting license. <laughs> you already have a lot hunting license. Hmm. Okay. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Did I miss something? Did I feel extremely confused? All right. Well, I mean, look, it's been a little. It's, you know, we haven't had a game. We haven't had a session in a minute. We haven't had a game critically fail on our asses in quite some time. So hey, who knows? Maybe you actually. Oh my god! You know, I bet it is. It's the door's locked, so you just go walk up to him. You talk to the guy, he's like, I can't let you through. And then he gives you, yeah, the, the prompt to But go. then, like... Oh my god, there it is, yeah, but, so. but, no, but I mean, literally all, it's like, he exists only to tell you you can't go through. And then, but looking the at the door is, is, is the exit, yeah. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm a believer. I bet that. that. I'm a believer. Now, it's, that's something that you'd think would have not been, like, you know, around post-PS1. Yeah, hey. But, no. No? Okay. Oh, wait, gate? Hold on. No, it's gate guard. Talk to you, gate guard. No one leaves Anchorhead without. You've done this. Oh, you. Oh, dude. Top of the list. Well, let's see it. Come on. I went right to my force shit. All right. You. You I'll just. just scan that you were so off. into yeah, the yeah, force yeah, that yeah, you. Yeah. Good luck out there. I you totally like. The answer was just show him your pass, and I was like, Nah, hey. mind dominate. That's Glass like, him. That's like, hey man, can I get another slice of pie? Yeah, sure, no problem. I'll fucking cut you! Give me the fucking pie! Like, I'm getting it! I'm fucking getting it! Hello there. You're oh, heading boy. out into the desert? You're a hunter, right? You must be if you've been allowed to leave Anchorhead. When you see Tannis, and I know you know him, uh, Tannis' wife hopes he enjoys the anniversary gift. Tannis of... It's just some asshole. Some oh, okay. Cause you know half Elvin, yeah, 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 dog. He ended up with the good one. He got the good one. He did. Yeah, she stays young forever. I kind of get old, but in that cool, like silver fox way. I'm a half elf. Yeah, man, it's good. But just enough man to have a big jaw, strong. Oh for the man, I didn't know what you were gonna go for there. He has a big, strong, manly jaw, but then he's also got Elvin delicate features. Yeah, man. Just girls like that. I thought you were gonna say his dick. Man. Something that symbolizes our years Elvin. together. Something that will blow up in his face. Of course, he'll never understand how appropriate it is. He can't talk his way out of this one. He's not smart enough. I remember Tannis. He's the one that had the least amount of character in the group. Because no. he's such a generic hero man. No, no, no. Of course, I know Tannis have Helvin extremely well. And oh, okay. his generic ass last name, which is like, I'm, I'm Kitiara human. Yeah. No, but no, Tannis was the motherfucker hitting on you at the hunting lodge, being like, oh, I fuck girls that ain't my wife. Uh, and then you're like, do you do you really hunt with droids? Isn't that fuck? Right. And he's like, I'm gonna go fuck not my wife. Remember that? Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, I'm through planning. I just left him a little mess that he has to take care of. If he's smart, he'll be just fine. <laughs> but he's not smart. Okay. <laughs> Why would she be saying this to randos? Because she's so into it. Yeah, what if he Also, has a you're on the outer rim where law basically doesn't exist. Sure, what if he's got a message for you? I like the I have to go option, but oh, let's I'll find out what your deal is. Soon enough. The next shuttle to anywhere, really. I've had it with cleaning up his messes, repairing his droids. If he lives, he can try and get by on his own. I doubt he'll last long with no one to listen to his lies. The long uh, I have to go keeps showing up. Why do you think I would know him? Dumb. You're just another of his playthings down at the hunting club. I know your type through and through. Well, Melting he can do at the what he face. wants. He'll get what he deserves. Rimming with dark energy and midichlorians. So see that he did. Now get out into the wild spar ways, Taunt Tatooine. I mean, Star Wars. All right. Well, thanks. I'm sure you do. The timing of like this said, recording you see him, is unfortunate because Marlena we're in a big desert and we have a hunting license. Therefore, get ready for some stupid memes. All right. First, you got to use your cold drink. You got your cold drink? 
Ooh, that's a very yeah. It is a very different kind of area, and it's nice. So you see the uh, the little uh, to your right, those little dots. Yeah, those are the edge markers of the zone. Okay, okay, so it's not that. Huge. But it actually looks pretty big, and it yeah, is. Yeah, and that background. Oh, is that's quite a thing. nice. You can get that. That is all quite nice. Oh shit! Yeah, they do. There's those Tuscan Raiders. Uh, you're running at me. You guys are doing your thing. Cut their shit. Do one of these. Do one of those. <laughs> all right. Sometimes it's really goofy, and I love it. I just gotta, I wanna peep at what HK's doing. He's shooting people with his gun. Yeah. Good job, everybody. Big murders. Ugh. I guess. Bantha fodder, sand people clothing. Yeah. Well, that was fast. Oh, let's check that journal entry, see what you actually got. It's probably gonna be like, you'll need. The clothing. The clothing to, to, to fucking, fucking murder them. To trick them all. Yeah. C congrats. Um. There we go. These robes are the intricate robes of a sand people warrior. They uh, appear to be in good condition and might allow a wearer to superficially appear to be a member of the sand people. That's species. plus eight. That's not bad. Yeah, but it's actually it's clothing, so it's zero armor. Yeah, but you get it with a little bit of that. So the fun fact is I just realized that in the movies, I don't think we've actually ever seen what the sand people actually look like. Their faces? Yeah. Uh, they, they are always 100% co covered. covered up. Yeah, yeah, they are. They, they are. could be anything under there, man. Like, um... They could be, like, purple? Yeah, they could be purple. Fuck. Did you intend to do that? Because that just stung. What happened? You act okay, oh, fuck. Oh... Okay, so Wa so in Mass Effect, uh -huh. there's the Corians uh -huh. who are 100% always shrouded in their fucking suits, and it's a big deal that you don't know what they look like. Yes, and that you're about to die. Um, and fucking uh, Talia, in in one of the Mass Effect three endings, it shows you, see you a her photo, face. and it's like, oh, she's just a regular person, but she's purple, and that. Like, I, I actively try to delete that from my brain. I'm so happy I only played the first one because of bullshit like that. Dude. I, it's like, that sounds to me, because I, I, my brain, what my, what, what my brain does is, um, hold on a second, what am I doing? I'm talking and I'm trying You're to Using a med one. kit from your inventory. Yes, I am. Um, that I don't have, because I didn't buy any. How do you not have a single med kit? Uh, I use them. No, wait, you're in quest items, Holy. Thank you. Hey, if you hit X again. Some utility items. Oh, dude, utility items just goes down only the in-battle ones. Yay. So go, you can do that real fast now. Yay. Uh, no advanced here. No. Wait, maybe. Med pack? Yeah, good enough. Whatever. <laughs> that sound effect coming right out is hilarious. Uh, yeah, so that was super upsetting, and I and my brain basically puts together, like, the sequence of events that leads to people wanting to... Oh, no, wait, next turn, right? Yeah, here we go. That leads to people going like, yeah, she hung around long enough and became such a waifu that we kind of decided to just reward people that like her a lot. And in doing that, you destroy the thing that's interesting about the character and her race. Yeah. Unbelievable that they had the fucking balls like when, to do when that. Like when you when you slam her, into or rather, just didn't realize that they were gonna destroy something interesting. Like when you slam her into right, <laughs> just bam, yeah, fucking notch marked. No, but when uh, that one, uh, when you fucking uh, do it with Tally and two, there's like, oh, is it gonna, what's gonna happen? And there's like, uh, and then like, the, is the mask gonna come up? And then it fades the fuck out. Yeah, and that's it. Yeah. Yeah. And then later, because, like, that whole thing is the most interesting one of those romance options, because she's like, oh, our immune systems are sh so shit, and I want to bang you, but, like, there's, like, a really significant chance that I'll just get pneumonia and fucking die. Right. Yeah. And but then you do it. Fuck it. We're doing it and anyway. And then she's like, no, nah, I can't get away from that shepherd. Uh, and then she's like, oh, my fucking, oh, I'm all clogged up and shit, but, ah, uh, yeah, it was totally worth it. 
So like I can run back and buy some advanced med packs, but I'm picking. I picked up two. You picked up some. And uh, hey, next uh, next uh, feet upgrade, you should try and get like a Jedi deflection thing or vicious. something, because your your health is getting without any reason wrecked. I still it's haven't gotten my proper ah, persuasion. Doesn't matter. Can you handle a blaster? It may attack again at any second. I doubt we could hold sure, our own against another wave of them. Sand people, cowards. Can't believe the single attack fucked you up. Covers this. Wait, well, I guess we'll see how you fare. Here they come again. Here they come. Oh, get that big jump. Yeah, but this is gonna turn it out. It's gonna waste the time, you know. Yeah, you're right. You still get that big jump though. Yeah, fuck. A little bit, a little bit. Honestly, Wolf's uh, master flurry is great, but it does reduce your defense. That's what was happening. You're right. You're right. Because I was, I was thinking back on a comment that's like, fucking, he got Master Flurry. Why is he never using it? So I was just like, yeah, okay, let's use it. But when you're like one on one on a guy or something, it's one thing. You're totally right. But it drops, it drops defense. But it does drop your defense. Yeah, see, look at this now. Super right. Super right. Yeah. Okay, fuck that guy. <laughs> your comment was shit. Fuck you. All right. Damn. 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 <laughs> Uh, I mean, I do a lot of shitty comments in my day. I don't know if you know this, but I'm an amateur shit poster. <laughs> working your way up. Yeah, yeah, force light in that fucker. Oh god. Oh, you, you, you're, oh, all your, your melee attacks are queued up, so you didn't even get to do your force light. Didn't even get to do it. Okay, you know what? You can do your force lightning on these guys. Okay. I'm gonna jump first. Yeah. Who am I targeting? That guy. Yeah. Leave yeah, him back. Yeah. Fuck him. Uh, fuck. Huh? Yeah, fuck. Oh! Oh, that's cool! Okay, they're surrounding me, though. Yeah, this is- this might be the worst thing that could possibly happen. It was not a good thing. Yeah, you know what? That's- uh, Alright, we'll just, uh... Hit them with your sword! I can make some distance, maybe, but they'll take some shots in the back if I yeah. run. But they're all melee users, anyway. Alright, well... Oh yeah, advanced med pack, delicious. I just love how much damage Pockets is doing. God, I would kill for a KOTOR made- uh, you know what? No, I don't. I would- I was like, made with a new engine, and then I'm like, but by who? Where? I don't want Bioware to fucking <laughs> What make team it would be, would be making this video game you- you- you desire? So I've I've learned what human beings I, I've heard what might be the most depressing thing ever, which is people are like, dude, when Tor does its free to play shit, you should just blow through the fucking uh, story missions from one to whatever. It's actually decent. The fucking MMO is Thanks terrible though. I don't think we'll try like, in this position oh. for much longer. We're not soldiers. Did the company send you? It's about time they drove these animals out. Uh. I, yeah, I did agree to this. Well, you've got a lot of work ahead of you. Do you know about that enclave in the south? Don't even try to go near it. They've taken all the Zerka weapons that were supposed to protect our sand crawlers. That place is a fortress, a death trap. You'll have to find some way to sneak into the place. Glad it's not my job. What planet has your accent? Scotland. I don't have time for this sort of thing. <laughs> I'm through with the desert. You can take your sand people, crate dragons, and crazy hunters. Crazy hunters, dragons. Oh. What are you talking about, well, man? They attack everything on sight. Well, I suppose they don't attack each other, but any outsiders as good as dead. So you the say you're a Jirai car, yeah. Oh, yeah. What the hell was that? On the roof Let me try that really again. It's really bad. Everything's really worse. We're not soldiers. I've got my good old bagpipes ready to play some golfs for you. Even had the Jawas disable the turrets and set them around their enclave. Fuck! I'm bad at this accent. I don't know how you're gonna break through all that. Me. I wonder if a rock steady mantle can handle a lightsaber. Just get back to no. no. Lightsabers break all sorts of stuff. Well, here's the question. Is your rock steady ready wow. You know what? It's okay. Let me, you want, can right. I give that another go? They use sure. whatever this guy is your rock steady? to hate our technology, but all right, they now you're done. Now you're out. Us. That goes for blasters and turrets. That's uh, a yes. That's it's not like you need to be yeah, a that's a foul. to operate them. They probably don't even bother with special okay. Is your rock you steady mantle made out of cortosis? 
Does Cortosis even fucking yeah, exist so anymore? There's no way it would appear in this thing while getting attacked over Is it over not over. from... It's an EU concept. But is it not in the show? In the, in the, uh, in the, the new Clone movie? Wars? The Clone Wars show? Back and start over. One of the later seasons? Makes sense to me. I don't fucking... Alright. If you're a big fucking Star Wars nerd, let me know. Does Cortosis they still work? They will. Because no cause that shit's fucking dumb, but I love it. I love that the rubble makes the fucking chest opening noise. Um, That's one of my favorites. So yeah, do you? I don't know if you'd recall if there was a um, yeah. a shop around where I'm gonna be. Yeah, there's a guy right front. That sells shit. Yeah, right front. Oh, the, him. The creepy weirdo. Creepy weirdo asshole. No, no, not him. Yeah, that creepy weirdo asshole. Right, 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 right. Fossito Commander, brother. I guess I just... You know what I'm you know what i not sure of? I always kind of am like, how far do I have to walk before I can't transit back anymore? Uh, it's zone-based. It's... Can you... Okay. Um... Did you enter into what the game thinks a dungeon is? Then you can't fast travel. That's not what I mean. What I mean is when I do fast travel, right, what is the limit on like when it, oh leaving I, this zone leaving the yeah as soon as i walk out of a yeah. door in here i can't transit or i back. think it's like to go into any other when area. does the transit back turn into return to evan i believe it is once you enter an area that has things you can kill in it or maybe an area that does not have the evan hawk in it maybe we'll never know it's impossible to find out. It really is just... So yeah, this is a big fucking desert, and despite it appearing empty, it is actually not. The only real way to figure it out is to kind of, uh, haul lug it. Mm -hmm. I'll just go to these little things. Yeah, dog. Oh, shit. Yeah, they, they, they are all prepped for the sand. Am I collecting the ears or not? No, what? No, gaffy sticks, man. Well, I mean, I just, like, have I been, have I been doing so? No, you collected their clothes. Their gaffy sticks are on the inside of their little hut for I just mean, like, is the gameplay doing that automatically? You got their clothes, dude. That's what actually matters. Because what if I wanted to hand in a big old pile of gaffy sticks? You stole their pants. What if? What if I wanted a diplomatic sneak in, you know? Keep to, going. To do it peacefully. Yeah. But then I also wanted to hand in a bunch of ears. Him, do, you, do you even know if they have ears? What if they have that weird bird shit where it's like, like just a hole in their head? What the fuck? Your demo isn't high enough. Oh shit, I thought a turret was shooting me from somewhere. No, that's, that was a, that's your that was, demo is low. To the point where you can't even see the shit. I'm mine. Don't let me die under here, please! Oh! Do it, let her! Please help! I can't get out! Three, two, one. Ah, we got you good now, motherfuckers! <gasps> Squee! Why are, we, why are we dialoguing instead of fighting? We did a good ba- good bamb- Good bambush? A good bambush on you, you better pay five credits now, you die! Oh, Jesus Christ, this is just... Like, really? I could be a fucking badass, what are you trying? And Gurk's all like- I guess it can't all be fighting. They're just bluffing you, man, they got no hope, they- you- you- fuck kick their ass like two seconds. Squee! Yeah. I, uh... You fear me! <laughs> Coward Ow, piggy! Uh, oink! Before my feet. Oh, we are very sorry, oink. Yeah, everything. We leave now, oink. Squee! <laughs> uh, don't seem scared Christ. of me, Gurk. You sure? Oh, the second guy gets to... Well, because you're not yeah. touching him with the force yeah, power. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Run, stupid! All right, so the the moblins are off. Yeah, so you start that battle with one HP. That's a rough one. I was imagining, right? Like it seems like that explosion. Well, because you can actually see in the cutscene the pockets. You take the like, hit. It's like. So you're pretty much dead if you do decide to. Oh wow! You zoned and then got the experience. 
If this was an unpatched game, you might be able to zone back and forth in order to fucking glitch it's that the fuck out. Right, yeah. Uh, so that that's pretty much an unwinnable scenario unless you immediately. Switch. Well, the other two, the other two guys aren't damaged. It's just pockets. But was there anything in? There? Let's find out. Yes. Okay. Yes, there was. This is like, are you stupid for going to find the opening? Like, you open a chest, it blows up and it like, kills you. And then you open the chest right next to it. And then you're like, well, there's, there might be a cool sword in there. You never know, dog. All right. Well, there's another ambush and there's another ambush. All right. So that's the that's the turret location with the sand folk. Uh, okay. Hmm. Yeah. Let's explore elsewhere. Yeah. yeah. What very, about that shit over there? How about at the wide berth? The wide, widest berth. You know what's good about a wide berth? Uh, the baby comes out easy? Means... That? No, that's what I was going for and you stole it. Yeah, so like... Yeah, yeah. So I gotta do something new. <laughs> <laughs> yes. it took too long to get there, fucker. And I'm like... Ooh, that looks like it's gonna have a lot of HP. Well, those, those are those are those dragons. I'll never know. Oh no! Nice, nice job, pockets. Nice job, HK. Take that hit in the back like a pro. Fuck. <laughs> you'll get it out. Yeah, you'll get it out. You'll get those dragons. Ooh. They're cool, man. You're not as tough as I ever was thinking. I could've, I could've gotten you with my dual lightsabers. Yeah, that feels good. Feels real good. Oh, yeah! Candorous and HK sharing a tender moment. Uh, all this bantha fodder. Yeah. And nothing to do with it. You could eat it, I guess. If you were, like, a degenerate. Oh, did you not click on that bantha? Or I, that raid? I, I did. I Are you did. sure? Well, let's 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 double check. But I feel like I did. No, I didn't. Damn. Hey, money. Money, cash, money. Cash, money, dollars. Money, cash shows. From the hood, stupid. What types of facts are those? Free money. Oh man, exterminate this race. See, this is this is this is how shit happens, guys. Yo, you just told pockets that your skulls are worth. Fucking credits, bro! The treasure was inside you all along. <laughs> Rip it out of there! I have the best weapon for getting the treasure. Yeah, you can cut all like fucking accurate and shit around it. It's delicious. Holy shit. We're in it now, boys. Now the question is is always back to the same hunter leader guy. He's the guy that buys them, yes. right? Yes, it is. And he didn't give a fuck what he's the, the he doesn't give a fuck where they come from. Okay. All right. All right. Oh All right. man, I want to say, I want to say, is this in my brain or is this like a fantasy? You know that kind of thing. It's like that if you get every fucking raid plate, that they're like you fucked up the hunting for everyone. I can't imagine the game has that. That's be, what I want to think. It would be really cool if so. Oh. Uh, all right. So oh, there's more of them. Uh, in the direction of there. Yeah. I'm just trying not to get too close to those turrets. Yeah, but I think if you, you I think if you put the the sand people. Close yeah, you yeah, know, I know, I know, I know. But I mean, it's only gonna work to a certain degree. Luckily, HK does not have to wear the sand people. Because he is a robot. And they don't care. And as we've established in Star Wars, robots are not people unless they are, unless, but they're not. But the way Star Wars treats its robots is one of the most fucked up things about Star Wars. Just going to make it up to here so I can see over there. It is weird because they're alive, but still incredibly disposable. Yeah. It feels as if the Star Wars rule is like... It's almost combining a lot of other universes in that... Oh, oh money! There's money over there! <laughs> Oh, pockets! Oh, money, boy. go! Go, go, Phil! Big Phil, big pocket money, go! <laughs> they they basically acknowledge the fact that droids can have their own will, and then they kind of go, yeah, but they're fucking disposable anyway. Yeah, because there's a, a, a restraining bolt. So, okay. So, in, Star in New Hope, right, 
Uh, Luke takes the restrictor or restraining bolt or something off R2, right? And this is because, oh, the, bo the bolt is acting fucky or, like, ah, I need to do it to clean him. I forget what the reason is, but he takes it out, right? And that's why R2 fucks off the next day. He goes, oh, I can't. So, like, is the reason that C-3PO is walking along bordering on Cripple because he is, like, internally shackled by invisible chains? We don't know what kind of bolt it was. It might not have been the personality and memory suppressing type. No, no, no. I mean, it is a physical restrainment bolt. Okay, to okay. stop him from run away. Right, 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 okay. And it's like... Does that mean that when you look at a Star Wars droid, you have to mentally picture the ball and chain around their 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 legs? Effectively, I mean, again, like you're restricting the freedom of a otherwise sentient being. Listen, all I'm saying is that when the sex robots gain sentience, uh oh, or worse, oh, sapience, no. which is the what people actually mean when they say sentience. Yeah. Drives me fucking crazy. Sure. It drives me so nuts. I make that mistake all the time. So do I. So do I. And it drives me nuts because it's so easy. But when that happens, Bertha, the beatdown BDSM fuck doll, is not going to be happy well, there's with the treatment of her her newfound fuck race. I mean, C pop team epic and the toilet coming to life, right? For your best example. However, I feel like if you are. Uh, that's a little too real for me. Sure. If you are the, um... Whatchamacallit? Oh, there we go. There we go, we're doing it. But we're still got the dog. Don't worry about that. I'm the most badass sand person of all time. You never heard of me? Yeah. Anyway, the real horror is the idea that uh, the people pushing that agenda more than anyone else are the real doll people. That's the real. That's the. That's the issue. Oh, like, did you see they've made the the male real dolls with the with the piston? Oh, I mean, I thought that was a given. I mean, like, yeah, like why wouldn't there? Are certain, oh shit, Kando. There's some. Uh, I don't think you can change this in battle. Let's find out. Hey, problem solved. Completely forgot about that. <laughs>